How you doing today? Welcome to Mo's Math. Please become a subscriber. We're at the 3,000 subscriber number sometime this month, along with 250,000 hits. Today we're going to discuss weld gap with the calculator using the Pipe Trades Pro. We're going to change the calculator setting for our weld gap. So you can see in this problem, these are dealing with long radius weld elbows, open butt. We have four inch pipe size, three foot ten and a quarter is our offset. But our gap is going to be zero. Maybe you're working with stainless schedule 10. So if we press convert offset, first of all, convert clear, press convert offset, that shows the default setting at the eighth of an inch. Press convert clear, we're going to change it to zero. Press zero, now press convert offset. Now our calculator is set for no gap. Press the red clear button, put it to sleep, and let's put, our, put in our data. So you can see here we have four inch pipe size, three foot ten and a quarter is our offset, zero gap which we put in the calculator. And then we're going to achieve this for our travel, but we're going to achieve this for our end-to-end. -end. So let's go enter everything we have here. First of all, the pipe size, 4-inch pipe size, 3-foot, 10-inch, 1-slash-quarter is our offset. 45 is our angle slope. Our travel matches our sheet. If we press travel again, we have matched the zero gap for our application. So that's how you change the gap. So once again, press convert clear. Okay, default setting is an eighth, but maybe you want three sixteenths, you would go three slash sixteen. Press convert, offset. Put the calculator to sleep. Do not do a factor reset, and that'll be your weld gap setting. Next, we're going to cover fractional denomination. The calculator is set up for if you press convert, store, okay, you get 16th. That's what the calculator is set up for. If we want to change that, we could go press the plus, you get 32nd, 64th, half, quarter, let's go eighth. So we're going to do this problem with the calculator at an eighth. Press clear. We're not even going to put in the pipe size right now. We're going to go 3 foot, 10 inch, 1 slash quarter. Is our offset 45 is our angle slope we press travel and we get five foot five and three eighths so if you want to work in fractional denomination other than a sixteenth you can change that setting just remember press convert store and then press plus to change might want to work in 30 seconds maybe you're doing some clean room orbital work and 30 seconds would be appropriate for you. So that concludes our little tutorial for weld gap and fractions. I hope this helped you and there'll be more of this to come. Talk to you soon.